The Nashville area is experiencing tremendous growth. Unemployment is low, and you can stretch your dollar more here than in most places. News Channel 5's Mark Bellinger joins us to explain how a new study released today by the Nashville Area Chamber of Commerce says trouble could be ahead, though, unless the area tackles some tough issues. Mark. Vicki, that's right, and those issues include higher education, affordable housing, transportation, and poverty. <laughs> the importance of a meeting like this is to look at our problems as a region and try to solve them as a region. You can't do that in a vacuum. It was Nashville Mayor Megan Berry's first appearance at the Middle Tennessee Mayor's Caucus. So the challenge, of course, of my administration is to improve lives for everybody. And the, improving those lives for everybody means helping to lift people out of poverty. And it's a lot of what we're talking about. Nashville has had the prestigious honor of being tagged the IT city. Each year, city and county leaders get a look at the vital signs of the Middle Tennessee area. Things are going well in the Middle Tennessee area. The Nashville Area Chamber of Commerce report shows a strong economy. Job growth is high. Unemployment is low. Nearly 90% of people polled told the chamber the area is vibrant, lively, and an appealing place to live. But there are issues. It's become less affordable to live in our region. One is affordable housing. Check out the rising housing price index in blue. The per capita income line in orange is not keeping pace. These shifts within a five-year period point to the need for education and skills gains in all areas of our population. Businesses providing that income are worried. The report says nearly a third of their workers are approaching retirement, and right now there aren't enough skilled workers to fill those and future jobs. The survey showed almost 41 percent of Middle Tennesseans hold associate degrees or higher, which is higher than it has been. But that's way short of the statewide goal of 55 percent. If we don't do something about transfer we're all in trouble. Another issue in the report is improving transportation, which people say is getting worse. So it's very important that the mayor's caucus come together and recognize that mass transit is a critical component for the entire region. There are more persons living in poverty in Davidson County than in all 13 counties. Mayor Barry sees more poverty than anyone else in the room. Davidson County has about the same number of people living in poverty as all the surrounding counties combined. She says addressing the issues in the Vital Signs report will help those people. It's linked back to education, job creation, and transportation. Another concern is health care. The report says more than half the people polled said they had to go without health care last year. Nearly 270,000 Middle Tennesseans are without health insurance. Reporting live from the newsroom, Mark Bellinger, News Channel 5.